Stephen Emma here from Show Homes Online and we're in for a little treat today as part of our Christmas special we're doing we are at a development called The Village at Wedgwood Park near Barlaston really 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 nice development a real jewel in the crown for David Wilson Homes the house type we're going to view today is this one here it's a four bedroom Hartford house type just take a look how beautiful it is the detailing they've got that chunky rough render on it really nice double bay there as well double fronted two and a half story looks a beautiful house look at the detail on it without further ado let's go and take a look around hello Emma welcome to hello. the Hartford the Hartford by David Wilson Homes oh, at the village yes. um, and that's at Wedgwood Park in Barlaston mm. um, and it is all part of our Christmas special isn't it it's a three story yes, yes Christmas special show homes online styly isn't I can it i can already see it you know what i mean right yes so it's a four bed isn't it it is three two and a half story so this, four bed it is so this is the entrance hall there's a door behind you there yeah okay let's, let's start in there while we're in okay here. so we've got a downstairs wc in here haven't we yeah looks Lovely. really nice and then we've got the sitting room over here. So it's nice, it goes on. Oh, that's a lot bright. That's a lot better, bright, isn't, isn't it? It is a bit dull outside. Yeah, so it's, they've got a squeeze in a bay window to the corner there with the, on that side of the house, which is really nice. Right, dimensions five meters four by three meters two. Yeah, two big windows actually in here. And it mirrors that house type across the road as well. Quite a pretty house from the outside, yeah. I think. Very but, nice. Very characterful. Although full. this one obviously has got the white chunky render yeah. on it, which is lovely. Yeah, I'll tell you a little bit more about the development as we go around. I'll so we've got a bay at the front there. So Wedgwood, basically this development is built on the site of the former Wedgwood factory, famous factory, and it's absolutely a really lovely um, development you know really big executive houses here as well all sorts of rooms but uh, you'll see on the drive intro uh, how lovely these houses actually are well they've got the christmas tree so they've made it to our christmas special then, yes they? they had a tree made the effort mile. but it's Absolutely. nice that is you've got that little bit of a bit a little bit of a yeah pushed out <laughs> and that's it's a pushed out bay with patio doors isn't it french but doors. i reckon normally you'd with have windows a, as well that would be into a garden wouldn't it yeah but you've also got this bay here yes the garden will be on the side presumably yeah. on this this house very nice so you've got the dining area kitchen and dining five meters four by two meters nine. Oh, look at the phone did you see the phone steve you've got the old style yeah do you remember phones like that i Aye, do i did yeah so lovely kitchen here then with a wine cooler, presumably lots of things will be additional yeah. upgrades, so you need to ask the sales negotiator. Integrated dishwasher, lovely. There's your boiler in there. Super duper gas burners, look at that. Six, six burners on your hob. There's your oven and grill. Underneath. It doesn't seem an overly big kitchen though, does it? I think it's quite compact, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, you've got your dining area, you probably could fit a chair in that pushed out yeah. bit. Okay, so it's got a utility as well. So the utility's got a room, um, a door outside. Yeah, you've got room for two appliances. It's a decent size, isn't it? There isn't a sink, no. which I do like in a, in a utility room. You've got some cupboards there as well, though. Is there anything behind the door? Yeah, we've got a door, looks like a storage cupboard to me. Yes, as I've said, and the RCD box is in there as well. Also, we've got a little bit of the volume of the sea, the, the stairs just poking through there. You can just see the newel post, nice detail. So you've got the, the, the door to the uh, rear garden. Mentioned as well, that's your bridge freezer in there in the yeah. end, as well as all the under under counter cupboards. Do you like the pink? The pink? I love the pink chairs. You know, I'm into the shabby chic. I like the country country chic style. That's me, definitely. I like the door as well there with the glass panels in it. Yeah. Very nice. So we'll go up to the first floor. Then first floor. First floor of the Hartford. Yes, right. We'll go around this way. Got bedroom two there at the front. So this is over the dining room. Three meters, three by two meters nine. 
Pop me a light on Emma, please. Yeah, we do seem to be losing the daylight a little bit, don't we? So the village is part of this overall development. And if you look out the window, you can see how beautiful the setting is. And Wedgwood is like um, a park. I mean, the first phase was Lakeside, which is this one across the road. Um, predominantly five bedroom houses, but they've got a new phase called the Oaks. But this is the smaller phase, giving a smaller range of sort of um, four bedroom properties. Um, and this is called the Village. The couple of the other house types on this development, we will we'll put some links for the videos for those so that you can, yeah. you can see those. They were done some time ago, though, yeah. because they are beautiful. The street scene is, it is just the most stunning development yeah. to look at. It really, really But we'll just as you say, you've probably just seen the, yeah. the street tour that we've done. Yeah. Main bathroom there. So, main bathroom, we've got ideal, sta um, ideal standard sanctuary. Um, we've got no shower in here, but that's fine. That looks all right. Yeah, windows, very nice. Yeah, nice tiling as yeah. well. this sort of angle here on the landing and it's got oh it's your cylinder yeah. cylinder cupboard yeah Ooh. okay cool that's it takes a bit of room up that does doesn't it yeah so you've got the landing that comes around this is your bedroom one here your master bedroom again i think we're going to need some lights yeah. look at that for a light fitting then turn it on then wow there you go beautiful that is blingy, isn't it? Yeah. So, oh, wow. So we've got a dressing room and an ensuite in here. Do you know what I think it is about this house? Is the windows are very small, aren't Do you they? Think? Yeah. I think the day is pretty miserable. Like I just think that the, well. the windows are small in these. I, but I, I think that's how the architecture is, really. Right. Let me give you some dimensions. Bedroom one, three metres four by three metres one, just over. The ensuite in here is two meters two by one meter four, and the dressing room where you are, two meters two by one meter nine, just over. The the Gorgeous. they're quite smoked those mirrors, which are quite nice. Very nice to have a, a yeah. little dressing space, though I always say. Beautiful bed, king, definitely a king size bed, but you could fit a bigger bed in yeah. if you wanted. I do love the dressing table. So the the ensuite. Now let's have a look at this. So we've got yeah, we I've got the toilet and the sink, but you've got a double si double size shower cubicle there with a built in shower. That's quite nice. Quite good. You know, nice tiles as well. Beautifully yeah. interior staged. The interior design is always impeccable with David Wilson. We like it, don't we? Yeah. So that's a beautiful bedroom, right there. What feeling are you getting from this house? Me, it feels a little bit. It's compact, isn't yeah. it? It yeah. feels like there is a lot of space, but you've got to go up and up and yeah. up to get it. But let's just make me have a look before we go up. Look at the volume in that ceiling. Look at that. That's pretty impressive. It's huge. Yeah, let's go up to the second floor then. Now, I don't normally, um, we normally stop the video at the stairs, but we're gonna, I'm going to actually take you up here. You just up. so you, you can appreciate it. Got a sneaky window there. We can see it go, comes up now, and you've got Velux on the landing. But the ceiling height is still quite high look as you can see and you've got the v-lux you can see over there part of the development and the wedgewood factory it's still there making pottery right so let's have a look at the bedroom right there on that side you've got bedroom four bedroom four so that's it so so you can see there's a dormer I'd say it is probably a single bedroom. You'd struggle to get a double bed in. You could at a push, but you wouldn't get a lot else in, yeah. I don't think. But I love, I love the roof though. Bedroom four, three metres four by two metres two. I love the shape of the room. I mean, David Wilson actually give you the measurements in millimetres. Do they? If you're, if you're so interested. So yes. we've got another V-Lux here. You can just see down the street now, the village look. You can see a lovely, it's quite neat that, isn't it? The street nice? scene is lovely, yeah. I think, yes. Everyone's got their Christmas wreaths and things yeah. like So shower room on this level, two metres four by one metre four. Single, sh sh single, um, a single shower cubicle. Yeah, there's a door there. I always have to watch working, walking back in case I fall down the stairs. We haven't had no injury in showroom online yet. Anyway, you bang your head on light fittings. That's standard. <laughs> okay, last but not least then, we've got bedroom three. 
which is the bigger <coughs> bedroom on, on this yeah. level, isn't it? So can, clearly a, a double bedroom. Bedroom three, four metres two by two metres nine. So they've got fitted wardrobes that are fitted into the volume of the, uh, of the roof all along that wall. And that is a really good place for it, actually. It makes the most of that space. <coughs> so we've got a little window here yeah. in the front. We've had to put the lights on in every room, haven't yeah. we? Yeah. But I do think it is a pretty miserable day. But to be actually, the, I think the windows are very small in here. Yeah. I'm, you know, normally we've got a lot of really good stuff to say about show homes, but yeah. I feel this is a little bit, they've squeezed quite a lot into this, and you can feel it, can't you? You can, but it has got four bedrooms. Yeah, yeah, I know that. But downstairs you have only got a kitchen, dining room and a lounge. Yeah, and I think maybe. really the kitchen could have been a little bit bigger. Yeah, really. Possibly. But that's, you know, that's yeah. the only thing. I think, no, it's it's middle, it's it's one of those ranges, isn't it? It's one of those houses on this yeah. I, I mean, for me, the, Her the Hartford is probably the larger of the range on this development yeah. before you go up to the bigger four beds, maybe on the other phase, really. Yeah. But other than that, you know, it is a, a, good, a good typical David Wilson house. Yeah. But let us know what you think, because we'd be very interested to know if you've bought a Hartford, or if you're considering buying one, or if yeah. you're looking to buy on here, because this is an absolutely beautiful development, yeah, it isn't is. it? It's a jewel in the crown, really, of David Wilson, I think. Yeah, really gorgeous. Um, but anyway, I will put all of the details about the Hartford in the description box down below, um, also with a link to David Wilson's own website, so you can navigate back to that and, and take a look at what else they've got. Um, but if you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Um, and let us know if you've enjoyed our Christmas playlist. Because um, uh, everything with the Christmas tree, we've tried to, to cover yeah. for you this week. And uh, leave us a review if you get time on Facebook. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Catch you on our Bye. next video. Bye for now.